a really cool tool guys okay which absolutely automates certificate you know uh, and you will see that all your certificates also come to you automatically uh, but the tool is called certify m if you can see out here it's called certify m okay so very simple it integrates only with google forms google form uh, is integrated with certify m so let's simply do this together so whenever you sign into your gmail id guys yahan pe ek button aata hai google apps naam ka okay which you all can see and from there when you scroll down i'm just going to zoom in a little from there once next to your gmail id this is for gmail once you click on this you can go and you can create something called google forms okay now once you open this google forms once you click on this google forms you will get something like this okay and then you say i want to start with a blank form so you click on blank form and you start creating a form okay so the best part about this system called certify m what i want to show you right now is it can be used for feedback form plus certificate and it can be used for quiz plus certificate so you can do feedback form plus certificate or you can also put passing marks make a quiz and you can also send us a certificate that there are two options that you have out here okay so once you put up this google form guys okay you need to add a certify m as a tool to this so what you have to do is you have to click on these three dots on the right you click on them then you go down and you say you click on something called add on once you open a form you click on these three dots then you click on something called add on now all the google add ons are coming out here okay now you go to your go here and you type certify m okay this is the spelling of it this is how they call it certify m now in my case it's already installed if you can see out here in your case you will click on the install now once you have certify m once you installed it shut this okay go to the same form now and you click on this button out here this is called the add on button you click on it and since you downloaded certify m this drop down will come as certify m you click on it okay now you can see that the button coming out here called enable certify m in this quiz so i'm going to click on enable certify m in this quiz certify m is now enabled for use in this quiz so you say click on get started now once you do that the form has changed certify m is popping up out here now here's the first thing that you got to do you got to click on settings then you click on collect email addresses very important because the certificate will go to those emails so you always have this option ticked response receipts i don't want my people to get a receipt of their response it doesn't really matter and now this is a very important button which people forget require sign in which means that people need to keep signing in if they don't have a gmail id if they have a hotmail redis mail yahoo mail they won't be able to do it so un unclick this as well if you want to limit everybody to one response so that they can only fill this quiz once or the feedback form once limit to only one response okay do you want to allow them to edit none of these i care about then you click on presentation if you want to shuffle the question bar if it's going to be a test you can also shuffle the question bar okay you can put a confirmation message after they finish it thank you for filling the feedback form or you can say thank you for taking this quiz your results will be shortly emailed to you find an e certificate in your inbox that's what you can say then you can move to quizzes and right now you have to say make this a quiz you have to click on make this a quiz okay let it be as a quiz don't worry it's not supposed to be a quiz relax let it just keep on click on make this a quiz and release the grade immediately after each submission matlab after so if you given a test you can release the grade okay i'm going to click on save now i'm going to change this and i'm going to call it i'm going to name this sumaya vidya vihar university online fdp for example this is a certificate automator tool so whatever you type in the subject name out here now that's what will be printed on the certificate in the middle okay uh, it has to automatically collect email addresses so that can't change then you can collect the full name if you want okay you can create this form if i want now i can change this designation okay i'm going to add one more question out here and now i'm going to say college 
I'm going to add one more question out here. I'm going to say city and I'm going to keep this as a short answer. If you do not have a paid Google account, then you can do a hundred certificates per day. If you have a paid Google account, which costs hundred rupees or 150 rupees per month, but it also gives you a huge Google drive. You get 1500 emails per day. Now you can make this a test guys. Okay. You can make this a simple test. Okay. Uh, and now let's just say required response. This all is a required response. I'm going to make this all required. I'm going to quickly do this. And now let's say if I want to make this as a test and I'll say, what color is the sky? Okay. Now, if you see, I have said blue is the correct answer required and I'm going to call it one point. Okay. Guys, please hold on for a second and now pay attention to what I'm doing. I'm going to add one more question and you can make this a test. Okay. Or you can make it a feedback form. And now you can say is online learning important online learning is the way to go i'm going to say uh, true is the answer done now what i want you guys to pay attention i had asked two questions you can see this question is one point and even this question is also one point okay and now what i want to show you guys is now when you go to certify m you can say passing is 50 percent which means that if the student gets more than, if he gets more than one question, right? He'll get the certificate. If he doesn't get more than one question, right? He won't get the certificate. Okay. Or if you just want to make this a feedback form, you don't want to have a test. You can make the passing 0%, which means regardless of who answers what everybody will get the certificate. So you all can make this a test and then students need to fill the right answers to get the certificate. Or you all can make this a feedback form and change passing to 0%. Done. Chapter over. Right. Certification is on. Now, if you want to quickly just once see all the sample certificates, okay, click on preview all. Okay. So there are all these sample certificates, which are absolutely easily available, you know? So I'm going to choose this red color banner because it looks a lot like Somaya's red color. Just for example, sake, I'm saying I'm going to use this. It's called red ribbon. So I'm going to choose red ribbon out here. So I'm going to go and I'm going to call it red ribbon and that's about it guys. You can go to advanced settings and you can send them an email. This I've already sent to them and now I can say name of sender will be Karan Shah ID subject your certificate. Please find a printable certificate which you can upload on LinkedIn. as social proof, right? I can, this will be the content of the email. Okay. And send the certificate as a PDF done. Save changes. All done. Everybody, the test is over. You can see a sample certificate and this is how your certificate should look. It's pretty simple guys. I hope you'll have understood how easy it is though. Thank you so much. I'm going to take your leave. Bye-bye. See you. Take care.